God. It is officially time to put the women, the children, the lames, and the incels to bed. Because <laughs> we got panty droppers. 2024. Guess what? Whether you are on the end of the spectrum where you act like you don't know what this title means, or whether you're on the other end of the spectrum where you really think that's all it takes to get a woman, either way, you're a lame or an incel. <laughs> and I got news for you. Panty droppers, we ain't stopping. 2024. And guess what? It's catching on because a lot of other people are doing videos with panty droppers. Because <laughs> we understand what it means. Stop playing. Let's go. Now. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, the Bowtie Fragrance Guy, the fashion and fragrance guy. I talk about fashion, fragrances, and a little bit of grooming as well. So if you want to look good and smell great, I'm your guy. Hit subscribe. Make sure you hit the bell icon as well. So that way, when I upload a new video, you'll get notified. So you see the title, man. We got Panty Droppers 2024. Time to go. All right. I've already got the disclaimer out of the way and address the weirdos and the lames and the incels and all that kind of stuff that have a problem with this kind of title. Forget about them. We know what this is about. All the guys out there, the guys that have some swag, we know what time it is. But these fragrances, some of the great ones out there, whether you want to call them panty droppers or you want to call them great date night fragrances, fragrances to grab ladies' attention, all of that stuff really means the same thing, guys. So. These fragrances, when you talk about compliments or getting women's attention, are really, really good in that department. And I got some for you. We're going to get into it. So if you want to see what's on the list, you know the routine. Keep it locked right here. Let's get it. And guys, the cool fellas out there, let's keep making these lanes uncomfortable. Now, what you going to do about it? The Bowtie Fragrance Guy. All right, guys, we're back. Thank you so much for keeping it locked in. Let's get into it. First fragrance up on the list, 2024 Panty Droppers. You've seen this one before. From the Harmonist, this is Hypnotizing Fire. I cannot in good faith do a list like this and not put this on there. This is what it is all about. This is cinnamon, nutmeg, cloves, rose, and a poppinax. And it is just so good. So good. Definitely a, an attention-grabbing fragrance. Um, I told you guys recently I was in a convenience store. I was on the phone with the missus, and the young lady uh, in the convenience store was like, oh, my God, what is that you're wearing? I just laughed. And I, saw, I told uh, the missus, I said, did you hear what she asked? It was, guys, like we say, these fragrances can co start conversation. Listen, if you're a single dude, right, let's just give you a scenario so we can clarify this a little bit more. If you're a single guy, right and you're in the store and let's say the female might be uh, attractive to you that's a chance at a conversation that's all we're talking about man it's a great fragrance that gets attention this is definitely one that rolls in here the spiciness from the nutmeg and cinnamon and that smokiness from a poppin x is a winner so i've talked about it a lot you guys need to go ahead and check it out man from the harmonist get your nose on hypnotizing fire if sexy fragrance were a picture, it may look something like this. From the brand of Chanel, this is Coromandel. Coromandel, white chocolate, patchouli, and amber. That's really what this fragrance is about. It is so good. And again, when you talk about sexy, you have to mention this fragrance. The white chocolate gives it just the right amount of sweetness. And it works so well with that patchouli and amber on the dry down. This is next level sexy. You gotta put your nose on it. Even the name is sexy. From the brand of Chanel. Check out Cora Mandel. That rhymes. Maybe we gotta do that. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. This fragrance is on the list, man. It is new, but it is proving itself to be good. From the brand of Creed, this is Absolute Aventus. Absolute Aventus. Ginger, cinnamon, and vetiver are some new notes that have been kind of added to that Aventus DNA. You smell the original Aventus here, 
But to me, this is in a way a little bit fresher, spicier version of the Aventus. Not as smoky. Again, that ginger in there and the cardamom, that's, I mean, the cinnamon is spicy. So it gives a spicy nuance to it. Then the vetiver gives a little bit of a smokiness, but not that deep smoke or rich smoke that you would get from the um, the original Creed Aventus that you got from the Birchwood. But this stuff is absolutely phenomenal. Definitely an attention grabber, a conversation starter. From the brand of Creed, absolute Aventus. This next one, guys, is a newer fragrance, but my God, is it good when we talk about this kind of category, sexy fragrances, whatever you want to call it. From the brand of Mind Games, guys, French Defense. This stuff is just, <laughs> this stuff is crazy. Man, this is uh, Black Cherry Amber Geranium. Some of the main notes here. It really is about that liqueur like black cherry. All right, you have that, you have the amber accord in here. Smells absolutely sensual. Period, point blank, that's the one word I would use to describe this fragrance. It is sensual. You gotta smell it, fellas, from the brand of Mind Games. This is called French Defense. <sighs> Guys, this next fragrance needs no introduction. You just gotta try it. Just try it. You see what I'm talking about. Try it. From the brand of Louis Vuitton, Imagination. You talk about a panty drop. <laughs> this, this right here. Look it up right now. Look up fragrance panty dropper. Go to the dictionary. Look it up right now. You're going to see this right here. <laughs> right beside it. This thing is absolutely crazy what it does, man. It is very fresh and uh, very like uh, zingy fresh opening because you have citruses and ginger in there. And then you have some tea, some anthroxin, some uh, spices in here as well like cinnamon. This thing is, my God, just check it out. Check it out. Never worn it and not gotten a compliment if I've gone out of the house. That's a fact. Don't have to believe it. I don't care. Look at the dent in the bottle. From the brand Louis Vuitton, this will get the job done. Imagination. All right, guys, this next fragrance is from the brand of Electimus. Trust me on this. Just try it. Mercurial Cashmere. This is Mercurial Cashmere. I wore this the other day. Cardamom, amber, tuberose, tonka bean, vanilla, caramel, sandalwood. It is a really sweet, but not overly sweet, sexy fragrance. Now, I know the tuberose, that's a note that a lot of guys don't gravitate towards. I don't really, but it works in this fragrance. I told you guys, for females, they're attracted to things they're attracted to. They like florals. Women love tuberose. So you got some tuberose kind of embedded in this fragrance, but... It is really covered up well by those sweet notes like the caramel, the tonka, the vanilla, all that stuff. Fellas, I will not steer you wrong. Just try it. You'll see what I'm talking about from the brand of Electimus. If you're looking for something sexy, a panty dropper for sure. Trust your boy, Mercurial Cashmere. This next fragrance is kind of one of the forgotten gems of the brand of By Killian. But if I talk about sexy fragrances, there are two brands that always come to my mind. Tom Ford, Killian. And this one is called Intoxicated. This is Intoxicated. This is coffee. This is cardamom. This is cinnamon, nutmeg, and vanilla. Man, this thing is sexy, man. It is so sexy. Like I said, to me, this is kind of a forgotten gem in the Killian collection. They have so many fragrances that are sexy and that are good. You know, Angel Share, you have Black Phantom, you have Straight to Heaven Extreme and Straight to Heaven. You know, just to name a few, but this one kind of gets lost in the shuffle, and it is one of the sexiest fragrances that they have. I think this one, Back to Black, really sexy, don't get talked about as much. But anyway, check it out, guys, from the brand of Bakillian. This is a phenomenal sensual fragrance. This is called Intoxicated. This next fragrance is from the brand of Christian Dior, and this is called Ombre Nui. Ombre Nui, Amber Rose, Pink Pepper. Ah, patchouli or something, man, you know, it's rose as well. There's a little bit of rose in here as well. The guys, it, this stuff is so sexy. Seriously, it is so sexy. Listen, rose. But again, this is not rose oud, this is rose patchouli. So, and it doesn't smell anything like Portrait of a Lady, which is one of my favorite fragrances in the world. It's done in a different way, the, uh, the rose and the patchouli here. And primarily, I think, because this has a little bit more of a fresher scent profile. Um, with that amber in here and uh, like I said some of the fresher nuances that's what adds to the florals 
it's one that you have to smell all right it's like fresh you know fresh rose meets amber gotta put your nose on it it is very sensual and alluring from the brand of christian dior Unbelievable. guys and i had to put this one on here as well it's another one from louis vuitton it is almost as good as imagination this is meteore this one is called meteore all right this is orange neroli nutmeg and cardamom so again Another one that's really, really fresh and citrusy, and then this creates this contrast with these spices like the nutmeg in here. Almost as good as imagination, not quite. But again, you see the dent I put in it. Again, I've had these two fragrances like midway through the year last year. So they're in high rotation because they just work. They just work, guys. So check it out from the brand of Louis Vuitton. This is Meteoric. And last but not least, one that is always and will always be on the Fanny Drop It list. I have featured the other iteration of this fragrance before, but I will feature this one from MFK, which is still one of the best sexy fragrances in my entire collection. This is Ooh Satin Mood, it's straight to parfum. Straight to parfum, all right? This is rose, violet, cinnamon, vanilla, and oud. And I love that the cinnamon in here, the cinnamon and violet in here, that powderiness, and then that spicy, slightly sweet nuance that I get from cinnamon takes that rose oud DNA to the next level. And of course, this is the extrait. I get great performance out of the EDP, but the extrait is next level. Guys, you got I don't really have any words to describe how good it is. You just gotta put it on your skin and see for yourself. From the brand of MFK, Oud Satin Move, the extrait to pop. But that is all I have for you guys today. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. As always, I sincerely appreciate your time and attention to these videos. I know you don't have to watch, but you do, and I sincerely appreciate that. But until next time, I'll catch you guys on the flip.